Kathy Litchfield, and this is the process of weaving. Right here, I'm weaving cotton towels, 100% cotton towels. And what's really fun is having a really, really colorful warp and then choosing a weft color to throw through with the bobbin and shuttle and watching the pattern develop as you weave. So how that happens is that I step on treadles with my feet, which raises these harnesses right here to create different openings so that the threads float over different numbers of threads each time, thus creating a pattern. What I think is really cool also is watching the pattern develop as you throw the shuttle back and forth. So every single one of these threads, as I push it into place, forms a new part of the pattern. And you can watch it develop as you throw the shuttle. This is a craft that's been practiced for centuries all over the world. I've been doing it for 10 years, but I still love it. Every project is a new adventure. You can see what my feet are doing down here. When I step on these treadles, it raises harnesses. And that's what I was saying before about how it creates the pattern on the loom. So you can watch what my feet are doing. And as I weave the cloth and advance it forward, all the towels end up on this on this beam right here. These are all separate towels and I'll cut them apart right here and they'll have these sweet little fringes on them. to advance the loom. So when I do that, I lighten my, my weight on this rake, step on this, twist the fabric forward, tighten it, and then I'm ready to weave again. So when I get to the end of a towel, I'm doing this stitch uh, called hem stitching, where I wrap around a certain number of threads, and then I gather them together and poke the needle into the cloth to secure the edge. This is one method of finishing towels that I happen to like because it leaves a sweet little fringe on the ends, and plus it's really fun to do. So you actually take a needle while it's on the loom like this and stitch this up. What it does is it secures all of the warp ends so that they won't come apart, no matter how many times you wash it. And these are machine washable. Although I do suggest you lay them flat to dry or else they'll shrink a little. <laughs> 